Hello friends, today I'm going to show you the MI soundbar. As you can see here, this is a MI soundbar that is made from uh, Xiaomi and uh, as you can see this cost around 4,999 rupees in India but uh, if you have a good deal then you might be getting in a very low prices but I haven't found any lesser than that. So this is a TV companion soundbar as compared to the others like we have in Sony, Samsung now but uh, this is a cheap one but you get connections like uh, Bluetooth, Aux-in, Line-in, Spidiff and Optica. So why wait my friends, let's open this up and see what we get inside. So here we go. Packaging is really nice. As you can see, I um, have to pull this. So, on the box, if we check here, am I soundbar? Nothing else is written. The price tag and everything was on the paper itself. So, let's open this up. Here we go, my friends. Okay. Let's open totally, I think. But I will not do that. We get uh, a SPDIF cable. As this is a SPDIF cable, as you can see here. This is a SPDIF cable. We get uh, some screws to install it on the wall if you want it and uh, my soundbar installation guide yes, this is the installation guide as you can see here so inside here we need to pull this apart like this okay. We get a power brick that uses uh, 16 volt of DC output, like uh, it's an adapter, AC to DC adapter. As you can see. So, and the point is side and it's a bit heavy. But uh, as you can see, it is uh, in white. The weight is around uh, 900 grams to 1 kilo, I think, not more than that. So, open this up. So, as you can see here, we get the volume. Uh, let me focus this up. We get the volume down, volume up, uh, optical, speed diff, line in, aux in, and Bluetooth button. These are the buttons that we get here. Mm, these are the two wall mounting hooks here that we have here. And uh, some kind of the connections that we got here. Uh, let me show you here. These are the connections that we get here. Like this is the power in, uh, this is the speed diff. No, this is the digital uh, in, this is the SPDIF cable in and also we have the aux in and uh, I think this is the 3.5 mm jack 
and this is the power on off switch uh, we get three rubberized uh, shoe like structure here so that your speakers won't move from anywhere so I get for friends let's and also the front of the speakers as you can see here the front of the speakers is made of some kind of cotton cloth like finish it looks really nice and feels really nice on the hand so i will connect this up now to the desktop and we'll see what is the sound quality so as you can see here i have connected the power cable here and it i've switched it on and as you can see there is a light uh, glowing here with the speedy one but we will go to the bluetooth and the bluetooth is on now we will connect this and uh, we'll see how the sound quality works let's open this pc up and we go here add a device so it is searching for a device now add a bluetooth device here add the bluetooth audio device so as you can see on the screen it is now searching for a bluetooth device there and when it sounds that is it written here am i sound bar as you can see here let me zoom this up for you and uh, move the screen so as you can see here now it is showing there as uh, am i sound bar here as you can see here that is the am i sound bar here so i will select this Uh, it will get connected now it is connected as you can see it is showing music connected okay and uh, now we will go out so now we will try to play some songs here let me try something let me check the volume here i think the volume is very high might be so we will go to youtube So let me connect the uh, connect to some songs first and then i will resume the video so as you can see here it is connected now i have already set up everything and now i will show you how the music uh, feels here how the sound quality is so let me focus the sound to the speakers now the microphone to the speakers so as you can see here i am playing now some songs this is not songs is the uh, see here my friends so as you can see here friend mates the sound quality is really nice it has got eight speakers here i think there are two woofers here two tuners and four um, let me open the specification it will be easier for you to also understand i think four uh, bass reflection are here i think so i'm playing another music here Uh, for the timing to show you how the sound quality differs from uh, music to music and uh... 
No. Only thing I don't like here that they haven't provided a remote. You have to control the volume from here only, like plus and minus. This is the only minus point of this uh, sound bar. And also in the cost effective my friends, we will be getting this only. So, so as I told you earlier, we get uh, around uh, for two woofers here, around the both sides here. There are two woofers here. And also we get uh, two tutors here. There is uh, and 20 mm dome tutors. These are 20 mm dome tutors, both sides. We get 2.5 inch woofer divers here on both sides. And four passive radiators. One, two, three, four. If you can know, if you want to know the details, you can find it on this website that I'm showing you on the screen here. And uh, for more details like the dimension and all, you can check out the website. And I would recommend to buy this product for those who are searching for an audio device, like it should be in a budget and it should sound quite good. The, if I compare it to my Bose, then it sounds really good, but not that good as compared to the Bose. So I will show you a comparison with the Bose also. So here is my friends. This is the Bose SoundLink 3. So I know this costs really high than as compared to the MI soundbar. But uh, to be frank, it would not be a good comparison because this is a very big speaker as compared to this one. But let, let us find out what's the sound difference, okay? The same music on both the speakers. So here you can see the comparison. Now it is in played by MI Sonba. Now it is being played by Bose Soundling. So what I found out on both these uh, devices is that uh, no doubt it has very good sounds and everything. The bass as compared to the Bose and all you will find a bit difference but all in all the speaker is really good and really nice. With the price that point that has been MI is selling it's a perfect price for this and the sound quality is really nice. I would really suggest you to go and buy for this device my friends if you have any doubts feel free to ask in the comment section below I will be very happy to answer you out and uh, I would give it a go to buy this product thank you for watching do subscribe my channel bye bye